a border collie from the town of Onondaga. Just the latest case of animal abuse in our area. A man under arrest for animal cruelty. His daughter forced to surrender the dog to a local shelter unable to afford the medical bills. News Channel 9's Jeremy Skiba tells us already overwhelmed shelters struggle to pay these costs too. It's something no pet owner wants to endure. Marianne Smith surrendered her dog Willow May to Humane CNY after she says her father abused her pet and she couldn't raise enough money for surgery. I just want her to be healthy and happy. I would love for her to be able to come home and be with her friends and her family and her other pet siblings, but I would just want her to be okay wherever she is. When you see that face on that dog, it's like we just got to go out to the community and, and try to raise the money to save this dog's leg. Davison says there has been a rise in cases of abuse and abandonment this year, like Hope the German Shepherd back in May. A lot of people cannot afford to feed their animals, and a lot of people are getting evicted and leaving them behind. And sometimes it's weeks before anybody realizes that an animal's been abandoned. She says if someone can't or shouldn't be taking care of a pet, they can surrender it or find a different way to make sure the pet gets help. Sometimes it does take a little bit of time because everybody is so full right now, and foster homes are needed to help with the, with the overload that everybody is seeing. Seek a trainer, family members, see if somebody can help you out until there is a spot open. On a positive note, in 24 hours, the shelter has raised around $9,900 for surgery. Their initial goal, six to $8,000. We couldn't even believe it. Right after we posted, it was like, wait a minute, we might make this goal. We are just so grateful for this community, especially with, with so much going on, with all the shelters and rescues, and everybody is always asking for money. We are just so grateful that everybody stepped up for this girl. And Willow May is grateful, too. In Liverpool, Jeremy Skiba. News Channel 9. And a little more good news. Willow May had success, successful surgery and is expected to go to a foster home to recover tomorrow.